Hello again, everyone. We are Gaming by Gaslight, and welcome back to another episode of RimWorld Ideology. When we last left off, our new and unproven colony took out their first raider, who is presently bleeding out on the sand, because we don't have anywhere to store them. And by store them, I mean to, you know, imprison them until we can send them on their way. Or, you know, whatever it is we do with prisoners these days. And we should... Probably, pro uh, I feel I feel kind of bad for him. I'm not gonna lie. But at the same time, that is the life he chose. Or wait, wait, were you a he? Am I calling you a he and you weren't? In any case, you're the ocean's prom now. We'll commend your body to the sea. Tony, surgeon. Oh, you are a 50 year old female drifter of the hard rating belief. Green, reddishy. Oh, you know what? I have been neglectful, haven't I? I mean, I think it's... is it year-round growing? No, we do have a little bit of winter from time to time. But... That's probably too much. You know what? Better to have too much than too little. I want to grow the Tinctoria. And... Also, I would like to grow... A lot of cotton. That is fiber corn. Uh, an inedible fibrous plant which produces a small amount of a wood like. So Ooh, okay, so that's how we get. You see, I should have looked at some of this stuff earlier, shouldn't have I? Well, it's my own fault. My own fault for not looking this stuff up. I wonder if you can ride ostriches in this. I never tried that when using the Giddy Up mod. Can you ride ostriches? I want to believe that the answer is yes, but I do not know that for a fact, so it would be irresponsible of me to say that is in fact how it works. But I want to believe, so I will believe it. Alright, so yeah, we want ourselves a solar f- oh. Butcher table might get in the way of that. Eh. I want to build three solar panels, and then we'll kind of, from there, see uh, where things end up going. How I want to build it? Maybe uh, back. Oh, actually, I do need that. All right, so something like something like this. Okay, and. Actually, I like the idea of kind of building this sort of redundant thing for all the walls. And since the walls are not flammable, we're probably okay and won't end up dying a horrible, horrible uh, fire-related death as a result. Actually, stop that there, because we have established that we are going to need to bump this down by one. I mean, we could build everything else up one, but I think I'd rather build down than up. Uh, Nicholas, could you build us a bed? There's our top priority. All the cotton we can get, of course. Alright, good. So now everyone has a bed. So they're, they're still going to be unhappy about sleeping outside. What is this? My surroundings are very spiritual. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why, why did that go away? Oh, oh. It's because of this. The hexagonal... Okay, so we want to build hexagonal or hexagonal stuff. Like this lovely hex tile, right? Can I uh, build it out of... Can it really be only made out of... Come on. I want to build it out of stuff other than steel, man. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, episode three. Let's have a look at... I mean, for one, we've got all these cool uh, carpets. Mind bend carpets. Fine carpet decorated in a mind bending style often associated with drug use. Cool. Ah, there we go. Hex carpets. That's what we like to see. Morbid carpets, mine bed carpets. We got all kinds of carpets. Diamond mine bend carpets. Okay. Yeah, I, I, I do have to say, though, I'm mildly disappointed that the hex floors can only apparently be made out of steel. I'm sure mods will take care of that soon enough. 
Because I'd like to be able to make it out of marble and slate. Ideology. Or I ideally. Ideology. Ah, this is ideology, but that is not... Not what we mean. So this is not blocked. You know, this would also be a good opportunity to figure out... Okay, you're busy sewing. Rat, when you're done, could you, uh... Yeah, just move that. I want to see. Oh my goodness, it doesn't actually even block it. That is perfect. Though, having said that, reinstalling it like this would not be a terrible idea. But I, I'm going to leave it like this, I think. And rat, what are you doing? Hauling. Is that really all you have to do is haul stuff? You don't have any other jobs you could possibly be doing right now? I mean, alright. That, that's cool. I guess. Uh, we also need a research bench. Where is that? Oh, there it is. <laughs> Didn't recognize it because it was the wrong color. Are we actually going to make it out of limestone? That seems silly to me. We could make it out of... Are we actually... We've run out of steel. I would say I was surprised, but that would be a lie. I don't want to... Man, that feels like that rotted away really quickly. Which kind of makes sense, given... I guess I'm going to have to punch these in order to get any resources out of them. But I'll, I'll leave them around for now. I, I want to deconstruct all the stuff that has the potential to give us steel. And then... After that, once that work is done, we've cleared up all the junk, then we'll start actually uh, hauling stuff. Ooh, a quest. We can also gain some honor. What do these guys believe? It's a charity quest. People with charitable beliefs will be affected by its outcome. Oh, I didn't check that. Are our beliefs charitable? Is that something I could have... Uh, charity a thing? Organ use, sacrifice... See anything that suggested? Uh... Hmm. Yeah, I don't see anything that would suggest uh, charity is a big deal. I wonder if that's like based on. Hmm. Is there a way we can kind of get a feel for this? What ideas would? Culture effects, names, appearances, and symbols. Hmm. Maybe it's just individual beliefs people can pick up as they develop their own ideology. Poor guy. <laughs> We're gonna have to create, like, swords or something, so at least it's beyond, uh, primitive. Ritual opportunity soon. Gaslight's Fiesta. Opportunity expires after nine days and reoccur on the same day each year. Oh no. I'm gonna have to look into that, but... Oh, we have two days to select this. Eat honor. Oh, it's just a manhunting squirrel. Now, who would I want to get the honor? I mean, we haven't even established who... who the leaders of our ideology are. Can I, uh... Oh, I know I saw somewhere in this how you, uh, assign this, or assign these positions. Maybe I can't do it until I get the appropriate clothing. That, that, that sounds like a, a possible thing. Oh, no, I'm an idiot. It's actually right here. <laughs> oh, boy. Great psychopath, 50%. Okay, so as long as we're happy, we'll continue... Uh, let's see here. You could be the Commissar. Can't be a learner because you don't have good enough research. Uh, let's see. This role becomes active when your faction has free spiritists. Can I change the leader? Must be a spiritist. Requires a beret, which we don't have. Expectations get raised by two la- Oh. Okay, so that would go from very low to like moderate, I think, is the jump there. 
Okay. Uh, okay, it becomes inactive when your faction only has one. Requires a bowler hat or a veil. Um, you can convert people. Who's our best socializer? I feel like that's probably the person we would, that is, really? That, that's, <laughs> that's the best we've got? Oh wait, why did I? Yeah, you know, we'll have that. Uh, yeah, we need an animal taming person at some point. But you know what? Let, let's make Rat our uh, our commissar. Let's see. We're about to assign them the role. Uh, requires the following apparel: veil or bo I mean, these both fit in the hat slot, don't they? Unless they've been split so that you can wear both. Uh, wait until your colony. Okay. Well, you know what, if they suggest that, then I will I will accept the advice. Now let's have a look at that fiesta, shall we? Ah yes, the dance party. A light ball or a ritual spot. Light ball and loudspeakers must be powered. Now do we already have access to this? We do. But we don't have enough steel. What does this do? A spike mounted upright for the purpose of piercing and displaying a human skull. To some, displayed skulls are a symbol of power. To others, they represent barbaric evil. Skull spikes are an especially brutal and effective way to terrorize slaves. Okay, so that implies that we can, in fact, take slaves of our own. Now, naturally, we're not going to do that on this playthrough, but we could, is the point. I'm gonna have to make the styling station at some point as well. Uh, let's see. Keep tearing down the steel walls. In fact, let's let's be sensible about this and actually use the mass select tool. Oh, geez, a heat wave. That's just asking for trouble. Mostly for me. I do not like trouble. Oh, actually, we are already kind of working on all this stuff. Get that steel out of here. Yeah, get all that steel. Ooh, look at that, a, a fence of an ancient variety. Ancient fence made of reinforced concrete posts. There's a fence. Okay, block these animals. Wild boar, dromedary. You know, I think my dream of having uh, better fences, at least in vanilla, or like multiple tiers of fences, that seems to have uh, gone Sadly, un unanswered, but again, that's what mods are for. A slaver? Tisk tisk. Actually, we're gonna need air. Oh god, it's so hot. We're going to need air conditioning in every room anyway, now that I think about it. And possibly more than one air conditioner. So, let's see here. Maybe I should try to have the air conditioners facing the back side. That way, um, less likely that raiders will destroy them. That seems a bit more sensible to me. There we go. Alright. I don't think we can buy any slaves. Mostly because we don't have the money. But being able to recruit a just walk through my house yeah. Sure. You know what? This would actually be the perfect time to accept this. And let's, uh... You know what? Rat can be our, uh... Alright, there you go. Oh, I could even use that. Who would be uh, the best group to pair with? Let's see here. Alright, so... Nicholas likes her, but she does not, mostly because Nicholas has a annoying voice, apparently. Oh wait, Rat already has a lover, so it'd be kind of irresponsible of me to give... Uh, do you actually have a weapon? Can I make you fight? No, I, I cannot do it. Oh, and we're also just leaving wood lying around. That's kind of less good. Anyway, we'll uh, we'll get around to all this stuff. Rat, why are you sleeping during the day? Don't be silly. 
You're also hungry. We're going to have to do something about that. And right off the bat, we can't actually afford anyone. Wow, you're you're pretty good. Your skills. Archaeo Vetism. Oh, that's that's actually unfortunate. I can't move or dock the uh the panels. That's unfortunate. Anyway, getting back to uh to this, however. Uh, you don't have any traits I want right off the bat. If I had the money, I would free all the slaves and then kill the slavers. But is that, is that going too far? Probably not. I mean, here are 5,500. Who, who's keeping slaves? Tisk tisk, sir. Or madam, whoever's in charge. Anyway, uh... Uh, artistic and construction. So you got, you have some good stuff there. But I, I can't save anyone today, I'm afraid. Oh, and that, uh, giant demon squirrel is... Okay, there we go. Alright, and, yeah, don't, don't cower. You can... Oh, you're actually gonna help with stuff, are you? Uh, you do have a passion for construction, so... I don't mind letting you do that. Uh, we could auto-load. Wow, that was easy. Okay, well, there we are. Rat, you are now a freeholder. Pretty sure that doesn't cause any problems for us. Yeah, we'll go ahead and... We'll just... Don't land on my crops. For the love of God. <laughs> they did not land on my crops. Jolly good. Now, if I recall correctly, I have heard that they have changed how this works. Okay, so you, yeah, now you just... It used to be you'd like right-click on them, but now you left-click. I don't wonder why they changed that. I mean, I can see adding this, but I kind of wonder why I removed the old way. Alright, what do we got here? Room impressiveness. What does this do? Okay, so we actually... I may have, uh... <laughs> I mean, there's a chance we'll get honorable. But it is unlikely. Huh. <sighs> okay. Um, is... I mean, you know what, at this early stage of the game... Yeah, it's probably not gonna go well for us, but... I will... I will accept it. Too bad I couldn't invite these guys to join the celebration. Oh dear. Oh, you're just... Oh, sweet merciful Neptune, you're out of food. Alright, get me some meat. Hunt all the meat. Is there even any agave? That'd be a useful tab now that I think about it. Rare frumbos. I mean, if we want to really have some fun, we could <laughs> trigger the frumbos and hope that... Oh! Holy crap! Are you kidding me? It was like the most unlikely event to happen. But, uh... There it is. Assuming I can find it. Ah, jeez. Maybe I should have had Irene uh, give a word of love to them. You know, it would have been nice to see them get over there. I thought there was uh, supposed to be some kind of, like, plus mood boost here. How is it that you ate without a t Oh, maybe it's because... something. Uh, yeah, Rat has a gun. In fact, she's probably the only one with a gun that is worth, uh, worth hunting with. Alright, so I, I did kind of royally screw up here. I was not paying attention to our food situation. Oh, and there's no wind. Of course there's no wind. Oh, and this is also not even... 
Oh wait, you know what? These these are just like wasting power right now. There is literally no point in them. Should have triggered the frumbos and then hoped that uh, <laughs> these guys got in the line of fire. I, I should have bought pemmican from them. They have pemmican. And I mean, Nails over here is developing heat stroke, which is not good. Yeah. The blasted heat wave. 49 degrees outside. That is ridiculously hot. That is insane. Why did I choose a desert of all places? You Note, know we'll turn this desert into a gosh darn oasis. You, uh, can you kill that? Pretty please? There you go. Then... What? We'll butcher it. Did you actually manage to get the gazelle? You did manage to get the gazelle. You're our best chef, right? You are. Good. Start butchering everything. Then start making meals. And an iguana self-tamed for some reason. I mean, I guess we could we could keep it. Uh I'll call you I think I spelled that wrong, but Ignatius. Ignatius. Alright, jolly good. So we're gonna have a bunch of meat just lying around. That'll be fine, probably. And then cook. Why are all these animals self-taming? I guess it's because they realize that I am, uh... I'm killing them all, so... No, nails! Don't eat raw meat! You're gonna be so angry! Hey, there's literally meals right there, dog. Yeah. Eat and be merry. Lest you starve to death. Let's see, do the meals last lo the meals actually last a little bit longer than than the raw meat. So that's that's a good deal overall. The wise investment. Though not as wise as if we were appropriately uh, you know, getting everything going here. Not even it's actually hotter indoors, which makes no logical sense. I mean, just being... Ooh, what's this? Uranium. I'm getting distracted by, by things I should not be getting distracted by. Need steel. This is our best miner. That is... Oh god, Nails is down. Is it because of the heat stroke? It's a little bit because of the heat stroke and a little bit because of... Oh boy. <laughs> this is... This is not a great situation we find ourselves in. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, why are you constantly sleeping? You know, we gotta do the old wake up at 6 a.m. trick. Wake up for recreation. And maybe get nails inside. That would be, uh, that would be pretty good too. Alright, jelly good. So we've got all our meat and stuff. Why am I storing meat in here? I really don't want to do that. Well, then again, there's no point in changing it right now. We're going to be in for a rough time. Oh, though, you know what? Maybe if... I'll make it an electric tailor bench, because the electric tailor bench, unlike the electric stove, can keep, uh, can keep using it even when there's no power. I'll make this 24. No, that's not a divisible number by... There we are. 20... Wait, 25 isn't divisible by 3. Wait, yes it is. Wait. No, it is 24. 5, 6, 7. Uh, let's just make it 30 meals. 10 meals per person. Commissar rule. Okay. He has to expect it. Okay, so yeah. How do I do that? I guess I click on this. That's the celebration of Gaslight. Oh, I probably need to build a... Uh... Oh, geez. Is Nails dying? 
He does have serious heat stroke. Is, is there a way I can get that down? I think because he is... Okay, I... He might die. Not assigned to mining. Also not assigned to mining. Crap. Alright, rat, stop what you're doing. Like, how, how serious are we talking about here? It's at 57%, so yeah, he's gonna die... Within a day. I could trap and starve the Frumbo to death, assuming it can't go through my doors. Okay. I need air conditioning. What I am, uh... I hope that heat wave ends soon. Maybe I'll be... Maybe I'll get lucky. Uh, do 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 Furniture. Sleeping spot. Make this a medical thing. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Slaves are a thing. Okay. I'm gonna have to pull an all-nighter on this one. So it did say grandiose, right? But we don't seem to actually... Like, there's no, uh, mood buff in here. Okay, that's, uh, really disconcerting. How close are we to... We're not close at all. Alright, Nicholas, my man. Have you deconstructed all the possible steel? You haven't even begun to touch all the possible steel that we could have here. Come on. Get this steel, man. We have so much to do. And I have not been micromanaging it nearly effectively enough in order to keep us alive. That is really not good. Okay. Alright, Rat, you're gonna get us a fair amount of steel. You're gonna get us a fair amount of steel. Oh god, everyone's got heat stroke. Okay, start hauling that steel back. That's gonna have to do. Okay, haul that steel. Then when you're done, start building these things and get nails inside. Okay, work on that cooler. Rat. Uh, prioritize delivering to the cooler. Is that it? We're still... We're still short of steel? My god. Alright. I'll be honest with you, things are not looking good. Rat, there is no time. I know I've been putting you through a lot of, uh... A lot of, a lot of hardship here. We gotta get those walls finished. Oh god, that didn't even produce anything. They're so boned. Come on, rat. You can do better than that. I know you can. Nails is dying here. I'm just leaving him in the hot, hot sun. Damn. Damn me and my obsessive need for granite blocks. Okay, don't even try building that. Or that. Actually, cancel that. The extra four steel might be our only hope. Okay, build the cooler. Okay, you're working on the cooler. Good, good. Okay, once you're finished with that, I start hauling... No, start working on the cooler. We're doomed. Thank goodness, a psychic souve. Alright. Okay, so here's the plan. We... Okay, good. We're building this. The idea here, of course, is sweet and merciful Randy. It's 52 degrees outside. Uh, let, let's, uh, let's say 22. Actually, I'll... 23 is even, uh, acceptable. Okay, uh, carry nails. This is, this is what this was made for. Okay. 
Oh, good. And we can also keep him from... All right, turn off uh, the power to the stove. All right. If, yeah, if that's enough to keep... Uh, Nails is back up, baby, and also uh, the time is upon us to, uh, yeah, take a break. Good, good for you, Nails. You're back and alive. The rest of us are also still alive. We're gonna have to build better clothing for dealing with the hot, hot sun. But until the next time, as always, thank you all for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to hit that like button or maybe leave me a comment down below. Let me know what you're thinking and I will see all you in the next video.